Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. So guys, today I have with me the new Samsung Galaxy Tab A8 and in this video, I will show you how to use Smart Select. So guys, for example, you open uh, some web page. I open through Samsung internet. So you can see over here, there is a web page. Okay, and then now you want to take uh, some image or some portion of uh, this page and you want to use it, you want to uh, save it to your gallery. So how you can do it? So simply just drag out the tray, the side tray from here. Okay, and then you will see there are different options over here. It says rectangle, oval, animation and pin to the screen. So I will select the first option which is the rectangle okay so now i select it now i simply drag it okay so you can see it will give me the option to drag any part of the page okay so i just want to uh, uh, smart select only this image so i just use this one okay okay now i just crop it okay and now i press done over here okay now uh, once i press done you can see the image is in now this form and i can also edit it if i want to write something on the image okay i can write it okay you can see over here i can write on the image whatever you want to do with the image you can do it over here if you don't want to use your writing just delete it now if you want you can also share it there is a share option over here so it gives you different platforms to share if you want to share in your samsung notes or you want to share it to uh, your uh, with your friends through you through the gmail account or any place or any platform you can use it okay the last option over here is the download option so simply just download it it will save it to your gallery okay so if you want to access just go to the gallery and it will show the image okay so you can see over here the image is now showing over here so now the question is how you can um, access this edge panel okay how you can access it you see there are different options over here the edge panel is there so how to access this how to enable this edge panel so first of all go into the settings okay once you enter into the settings you will see an option over here it says display just select it once you select it on the right side you will see the option of edge panels okay so if it is disabled just enable it okay now once you enable it okay uh, you have to customize it so just select it I select now edge panel and then it will give you different options the first option over here it says panels so just select the panels and here it is giving you different options so for example it is giving you the apps option you, you can select your favorite apps then it is giving you the smart select option over here as well you can see the smart select option it is showing you the task clipboard there are different options showing over here so i select these four options okay the apps smart select tasks and clipboard so now uh, once everything is done you are ready so whatever you want okay uh, you can select any part of the web page so now you can access any part of the web page uh, just drag out the tray like that okay and then just drag it again like this you have different option so rectangle oval for example i select oval okay so once you select oval it is giving you in the oval form you can see now you can simply uh, just uh, select any part of your screen it is uh, showing you in the oval shape okay if you want to x uh, you want to extend it you can make it bigger like that and once everything is done just press done button and then it will show you in this form and then you can simply download it or if you want you can share it it will save to your image gallery okay the other option over here as well uh, is the animation okay you can use the animation option and, uh, and then you also have the uh, this one pin to screen option as well so you can pin it uh, to the screen okay so you can see it select whatever you want to select and then you can simply just pin it to the screen okay so you can see over here so even you close uh, this page okay you see the image is still there okay and even you open some other app some other function for example i open phone 
okay and then you can see the image is still there because it is pinned to the screen so this is how you can use the smart select in samsung galaxy tab a8 so this is for today's video i hope you like the video i hope you enjoy the video please do subscribe to my channel guys thank you very much